Now to a major change coming from the Vatican over its stance on same-sex couples. Pope Francis has formally approved and allowed priests to bless the couples. Gabriella Primus is live with reaction tonight. Gabriella. Yeah, Don Scott, we're told that this is a significant change for the Catholic Church, but Pope Francis and other Catholic leaders uh, say that they don't want the message to get altered. It's pretty big news, I have to say. It's a significant shift in Catholic practice around blessing of same-sex couples. Heidi Schlumpf is a senior correspondent for the National Catholic Reporter. She says the landmark ruling approved by Pope Francis is a big step, but also limited. This document is very specific in saying that in no way does this mean that the blessing could be, uh, should be interpreted as comparable to um, the sacrament of marriage. So it's really more for, I think, an, an informal blessing. It can't be done in the context of liturgy or the mass. Trump says for years she's heard that the LGBTQ plus community does not feel welcomed in the church. So maybe this will change that relationship. The idea that um, people who are LGBTQ Catholics could have their relationships blessed and get a blessing from a priest, I think is will help many of them feel um, less ostracized by the church. Many Chicago-based Catholic leaders were slow to comment on Monday. Colonel Supich, Archbishop of Chicago, released a statement explaining the decision. It ends saying, quote, here in the Archdiocese of Chicago, we welcome this declaration, which will help many more in our community feel the closeness and compassion of God. The LGBTQ plus Catholic group Aglow Chicago wanted to wait for Supich to comment first before giving out a statement. But a spokesperson did say that they're happy that the Pope has opened up the church to be more affirming towards the LGBTQ plus community. Live on the north side, Gabriela Primus, Fox 32, Chicago.